Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Today I just wanted to share with you guys um, just a real quick simple video on some of the projects that I have been making or have made in the last several weeks. Um, I'm going to try to get better at showing you guys some of the projects that I do craft. Um, I don't always do these in process videos and I don't always uh, make clips of the things that I make. I just craft things and I send them out to whoever. Um, some of these are for uh, personal swaps. Some of these are for um, Facebook group swaps. It just depends on the situation and what's going on. Um, if I know somebody is having not such a great time, I have sent, I've made stuff and sent them out. Um, it's just whatever I feel like doing. And so I'm not really that great at showing you guys the projects. So I'm going to try to get better at that. Um, at least giving you guys little clips and pieces of the things that I do make so that you guys just don't think that I am not using the things that you send me. I really do use them. Um, but with the swaps and everything like that, the monthly swaps on my channel, sometimes I um, don't focus on filming um, the projects that I make. <clears throat> So here we have a couple fall tags, and then here we have two Halloween tags. Um, I just love the way these two tags came out, especially the one with the witch's legs. I just think those witch's legs are so cute. That's a die that I had gotten from AliExpress. Um, so basically, if you guys don't know AliExpress, that's basically China. Um, here are some Memordex cards that I made. And another reason why I don't really show these projects is because, like, I want to make sure the person's person or persons receive these items before I film them. So I think everybody has received everything, um, all of these projects here. I have way, a whole bunch more that I haven't showed you that will be in another video. But for now, I know for sure that these projects have been... Um, sent and have been received. Um, here's a little loaded envelope that I done and I thought it just turned out so super cute. Um, I was gifted that witch ribbon by Lorraine and um, I just kind of ran with it and just paired the orange and the purple together um, and I just thought they were super super cute. Um, got a whole bunch of little handmade goodies in there that I made up as well as some store-bought goodies um, and I shared a whole bunch of stuff um, here is a um, card that I made and that little um, ghost I cut came from Maria and I don't know where she got it but that is like the cutest ghost I ever seen so I just had to put one of them uh, big bows with the button centers inside um, on top of her head just to make it look so so stinking cute I just love that little ghost and here is a card I just attached. If you guys watched that shaker embellishment, I just attached that to the front of this card here and added um, that raffita bow on top. And this one here, I just kind of layered a pumpkin, some leaves, and a journaling card with a doily in the back and added that little bow there. So stinking cute. I like the way these cards turned out. Um, these here were just a couple little treat bags that I had made um, for a swap and we were to make four of them. So I kind of just, you know, did some simple um, little treat bags and I filled them up with goodies. I can't even tell you now what's inside of them. I love that little skeleton. I don't, that was gifted to me in a friend mail and I've been looking for him, but I haven't been able to find him. So I know it's probably the, probably like the confetti pieces that come from Walmart, um, or Target or something like that, but I haven't been able to find them. Super cute though. I love it. Here is a fall themed one and those paper, uh, leaves there in the center with the pumpkin pie paper. Like I have bought two of those at Hobby Lobby and I have since used every single one of them. And I went back to Hobby Lobby and I can't find any more. I was really sad. Um, and that piece in the center where the shaker bits are is from Jennifer. She made those as part of her challenge entry. And I just took it right off there and added it right to the center of that pocket letter. I thought it went well with the colors inside the pocket letter. So I just, I had to, I had to put it there. Super cute. 
Um, and here is a, another Halloween pocket letter. Super, super adorable. I just love all the, and most of everything that's in here um, was gifted to me in a friend mail, believe it or not. Those little orange and um, black little dots down there on that skeleton pocket is actually the Dollar Tree filler. I just cut them in half and hot glued them on there. Super cute, right? Um, and this is a challenge entry for Tina at Starting Over. She's having a challenge going on. If you're interested, go on over to her channel. Um, you're going to see a picture of me here in just a second, but I'm going to cover up my address there. Um, I'm sure you could probably pause that and find that, but most of you guys already have it anyway. Top picture there is a senior picture, and the bottom picture is me, like, current... Um, and that about does it for this video, guys. If you like these videos, give it a thumbs up and let me know that you like it. And we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.